first type of like negative paradigm that we might have is one called friend-centered. What could possibly be wrong about that? I mean, they even made a show about it, right? We all like being able to hang out with our friends. There's nothing wrong with hanging out with friends. We all like to do it, whether we're playing video games, going to the beach, or going to the movies. The truth is, we have friends because friends share things in common with us, and oftentimes they're there to support us through our good times and our bad times. So what could possibly be wrong with having a paradigm of friendship? Well, there's nothing wrong with it. The issue that comes up is when we obsess over it, when we become really attached to it. Because the truth is, over time, we lose our friends. Our friends move on and do new things. Or sometimes our friends change. And when they do, sometimes we kind of wonder what happened to the friendship. The problem that happens when you can't deal with that change is oftentimes you become really needy. You really want that person to still be the way that they used to, for your friendship to still be the way that it used to. And here's the big problem with that. It takes away from you really being confident about yourself. And to be quite honest, at that point, a lot of your friends and other people kind of wonder what happened to you? Where did you get lost? And then the friendship gets even more difficult to maintain. The point being, you really want to work on yourself and figure out what you believe and what you want and then how you can work with others to build a really good friendship. In the end, there's really nothing wrong with wanting to have and having really great friends. The problem comes in when you expect your friends to stay the same or your friendships to stay the same. Really what you need to work on is trying to work on a paradigm of what are your principles, what are your values, what are the things that you're looking for in life, and then sharing that with others and helping others. By doing that, you actually build better friendships for the future. Thanks a lot and off to the next clue.